come guys be sure to subscribe to my channel okay so uh dx so this video need to prove these two facts so dx divided by second x plus one uh, integration and the dx divide uh divided by second x minus one this list okay so before i start be sure to uh subscribe to my channel and uh, click like button and uh, leave a comment below if you are uh, just leave what you learned today okay or anything what i want to prove uh, what i want to say okay so okay so we can prove this uh to do this uh we need to use a formula right i think everyone knows so let me just write down so we have this uh we have this fact right so co basically we need we need, we know that cosine 2 theta is 2 cosine theta uh, 2 cosine square theta minus 1 right if you let theta equals x divided by 2 then basically you will have you will have this fact okay so this uh so these things can be written as cosine x dx 1 my uh, 1 plus cosine x right because this second is just 1 over cosine x so this is cosine x dx divided by uh this one right so we can write as this <coughs> okay so okay so because now uh this is right so we so we are uh, we, we we get this okay uh so what is the next step right so what if i if i already I already go to uh well I, I I already did this. I know that the cosine x I I, I derive up to like cosine x, right? So basically the next is very easy. We just use the same again. We you change cosine x into two cosine square x divided to minus one. So we have this. Right, so we get the uh, one minus a half second square dx okay and the first term is x the second term is we know that the tangents differentiate in respect to x about tangent is second square okay so it's a half tangent x right but when you do a differentiation with respect to uh x you there's a half uh, well, it comes up, so it already become this, so we don't have to do this. And add the constant. Okay, so this is the proof for the first one. And uh, for the second one, uh, I think I don't have to uh, mention. But uh, 1 minus cosine x divided by 2 is just this. Okay, you just change. So you just change cosine to sine, and uh, the derivation is exactly the same. And uh, you will get this. Okay, that's it. I will see you guys in uh, other videos. Be sure to subscribe to my channel.